Hi, I'm Captain Ben Wolf with Sportfish Michigan. We've got a beautiful fall day here. You know, it's um, late October and we're gonna go fish a lake that we've never been onto before. And we're gonna use our uh, Humminbird Helix units to kind of scout out this lake. We're in search of some walleyes today. You know, we wanna put some walleyes in the, uh, you know, in the cooler for dinner, but um, we're gonna use our Humminbird units here to kind of really up that learning curve for how to dissect this lake. And so I'm gonna show you how to do that. Um, and it's a beautiful day, clear water. Um, hopefully the winds will stay light and uh, let's go find some fish. Because we've never been here, we're gonna use our Humminbird unit and I'm gonna use side imaging to kind of look for deep structure, but we're gonna use our sonar, just a regular graph. And we're gonna see at what depth zone those fish happen to be at and where we consistently mark fish. Then that gives us a starting point to then come back and highlight using this Lake Master chip in the, in the conjunction with the Humminbird um, to highlight that depth range that we were marking the consistency of fish. So those two things are really going to help us to quickly dissect the lake. You know, again, we're going to look for where we are consistently seeing marks as we're idling around. We're just going to zigzag across these structures, see what depth we're consistently marking fish. And then we're going to be able to go back into our map here and highlight using the Humminbird function here on this Lake Master to highlight the depth range so then we can get an overall view of where there are good, you know, structure points um, as well as in, in correlation with the uh, depths that we want. So let's, uh, let's go look for some fish. So we spent the last, you know, uh, close to an hour just idling around, zigzagging around these contours. You can really see my, my waypoints uh, where we found stuff, but as well, you can see my track line and it's really important especially on a body of water that we don't know, really get a lay of the land, and that's gonna help um, you know, really understand why we're marking fish in certain areas. And so what we've really come is there's a little underwater point here, and we've marked some really nice fish on that point. So that's gonna be where we set up. But um, before we do that, we're gonna highlight that depth range. The most marks consistently that we saw were really between 30 feet and 45 feet. So what we're gonna do here to show this is we're gonna highlight on the, um, using the Lake Master chip and the Humminbird, that exact depth range, that, that 30 to, to 40 foot range. And that will highlight on here exactly where I need to look on this map to see where that depth is. So we're gonna to go to menu and hit the menu button twice, menu, menu and then we're going to scroll over using the right arrow to the hb chart and then we're going to use the down arrow and go to depth highlight now i had that at 80 feet which was deep we were uh you know jigging some deep water fish but now since we're looking for walleyes in that 35 to 40 foot range we're going to scroll that down to the depth that we want so I want to start at 35 and then I'm going to depth highlight range. So I can go, you know, how, how uh, shallow plus or minus of that 35 do I want to go? So we're going to go 10. And now if I hit exit, exit, all that green is the zone that we're going to concentrate in looking for our fish. You know, we had a great day on the water today. We were able to locate fish using our Hummingbird Helix unit and really pinpoint the depth that they were using. And, uh, you know, by highlighting uh, the, the depth on our Hummingbird Helix and using that highlight function, we were able to pinpoint exactly where to fish and find that structure in that right depth zone. And uh, we were able to put together a really nice bag of walleye here. And uh, we've got some dinner and, uh, you know, and had a lot of fun at the same time. So get out, use that highlight function and you'll be able to decipher lakes a lot faster. If you're looking for a captain or a guide in the state of Michigan, please give Sportfish Michigan a call or check us out on the web, sportfishmichigan.com.